I'm going to do an exercise for Siamese Mahjong using the National Mahjong League card. Siamese Mahjong is when you play two hands at one time with one opponent. It's very challenging, a lot of fun, and you can play online at SiamesMahjong.com. When you play online, you have to make quick decisions. That's why I like to do Siamese sprints. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. I have my smartphone here with a stopwatch app. We're going to do three laps. Laps one, three, and five will be the sprints. Laps two and four will be set up. We're going to alternate between player one and player two. So we'll get 28 tiles, then 27, and then 28 again. Look at all those flowers. If we have any big multiples, no, but we do have two, four, six, eight. Look at all the two, four, six, eight. Two, four, six, eight with flowers. No, we have a pair here. Two, four, six, eight. I would hold all two, four, six, eight. And then up here, flowers. Okay, so like numbers with sevens and five flowers. Or maybe a quint. I would let those go. Here's nines. Nines. Two, four, six, eight, two, four, eight. Like numbers with twos. Two, four, six, eight. Okay. So I would maybe think about like numbers with nines and five flowers. I would hold the dragons for a potential quint if we can pair up. Our pairs are all with two, four, six, eight. Two, four, six, eight. Pair, pair, pair. Maybe play the third hand down. I would hold all two, four, six, eight though, just to see what comes in. This would take work. We do have a couple of jokers though, and I would want to leverage the flowers. Now, one thing we might think about doing is splitting out the flowers and letting a two go. We could play maybe the first two, four, six, eight hand, and then like numbers with dragons and nines or sevens. Either way, we didn't use any of those tiles. And probably these can go too. I would focus on the multiples here and the like numbers there. That, that's going to take some work. Jokers, flower, dragons, two, four, five, nine, two, five, six, east, west, two, three, four, five, six, pung in there, two, three, four, two, three, four, five, six, let's see, two, three, four, opposite dragons, east and west, dragon, Five, six, seven. Use these down here. East, west. Let's see. Five, six, five, four, five, five, six, seven. Okay, let's see. Four, five, six, seven, twos. Two, three, four opposite dragons. East and west with maybe sixes. Okay, wow, this one was hard. Okay, oh my goodness. Okay, this one's a mess. 
this one anyway. This one, not so much. Two, three, four opposite dragons. I, I was thinking about maybe a quint right here. Two, three, four, five quint. But we'd have to let a four go. I'd rather use that four. Another thing I was thinking is five, six, seven news pair hand. But I would want a plan B, and that's why I kept consecutive numbers. So I would keep those. If we're playing wins, I would want to keep the dragon and try for two, three, four offsuit dragons. And then maybe news pair hand or something consecutive with four, five, six. So I would let these go first. That one was challenging. Two, four, five, seven, nine, a little bit of wind and dragon, two, five, six, eight, five, six, eight, one, three, four, six, seven, three, four, four, five, five, six. Okay, okay, let's see, three, four, five, six. We might be able to do that one pure. Three, four, five, six. Then we could do two, four, six, eight of some kind. I would just hold them all. Ooh. Joker bait. Probably these can go. Not sure about these yet. Okay. So I would play three, four, five, six. No gaps. Maybe try to do it pure see about using these to help with the Kongs. Try to make them pure for a double point hand. That would be the third hand down. If we could do it pure, we could get 50 points there. And then up here, two, four, six, eight of some kind. We might be able to do four, five dragon if we can get threes or sixes. But I would probably focus more on two, four, six, eight in there. Two, four, six, eight, because of the fours primarily, or maybe consecutive. Maybe hold these as plan B and focus on consecutive. Let the wins go first. Ooh, that's going to be challenging too. This this might be fun to try for a pure hand. Okay, let's see how things went with time. If you're up for the challenge, try playing Siamese Mahjong. It will keep you on your toes. I promise you that. Let's see how things went with time. Sprint one, one minute 44 seconds. Sprint two, one minute 55 seconds. Sprint three, one minute 30. When you play online, if you don't make decisions within that two minute mark, the game will discard for you. So if you have a set of tiles at home and a stopwatch app, give this exercise a try. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click that little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next video, may all your picks be keepers.